how banned are you? And if they're giving you millions of people on the largest platform, come on. Are you really that influential then? Are you really that destroying the public and making them do battle the elites? Like, the el what? Andrew Tate is the best thing against the elites because the elites allow him to be on Twitter? It makes no sense. If Nick didn't exist, I think I would be an Andrew Tate fan. But then the stuff, I remember my chat used to always attack me for defending Tate because they're like, he made his power, millions is power, right? They said he got his power through. And you know, I have to start friends, but I say to their face, like, I would ban that so fast. I would ban that so fast if I was in power. Yeah, so that's why I'm not clicking your link. Like, I'm going to expose Andrew Tate. I don't care, bro. I don't care. All your links are or Andrew Tate some OnlyFans. I think the coolest part of Andrew Tate was that he admit he But when he took that away as well, I was like, oh, this is a phony. Because in the beginning, he's like just then capitalist, right? And then he said, oh, I need more backup. I need Muslims. The biggest plot twist, joining Andrew Tate. Well, I'll never be allowed to join because I JQ in detail for hours and platform Nick on Fresh and Fit. Like, I'm the bridge, right? Sneeko knew Nick for a year, didn't put him on Fresh Fit. Me, in my first day, like, that was hard to gain Myron's trust like that. It took, like, two days. But Myron and I, we get along, so it wasn't the hardest thing in the world. And Nick is no snake. Like, he looked at me and he said, John, you know what's going to happen? They're going to nuke you. They're going to come for your Discord. You're going to lose monetization. And, and then I was like, uh, you know, I, was, uh, I wasn't even listening to Nick. I was just hearing if I'm actually a Christian, I'll platform that kid. But, man, just like it was a, right after I get nuked. Fresh Fit gets nuked. I think this Media Matters did it, really. Nobody knows for sure. But yeah, Myron knew everyone. We had like long round table conversations about this because it's like, like you notice the Tate brothers disappeared when we were JQing hard because they're afraid that the 100,000 viewers would say, add Andrew Tate to the call. If 100,000 Rumble viewers said, add Andrew Tate to the call, imagine Myron, Nick, uh, excuse me, Myron and Fresh and Sneeko. They would be like this. That's why when I said Andrew Tate's and I said it like a joking thing, right? They had to shut it down because they're they're like, hey, let's not do that thing where we're testing how base people are. Like Andrew Tate's this base, Myron is literally, and it's so weird. Like you can never say John is a bad influence because I was yelling at Myron for a lot of things, but he'd look me in the eyes, no lie, he would do this. I don't care if I get banned off YouTube. I care about the truth. And I'm like, really, Myron? And he would say this about the Abba Preach stuff, too, when he was doing that. So it was shocking to me. And Fresh was like, I don't know if this is the right move. And, and I remember I said, I'll never make the decision for you guys. But you guys had Dawson on, so that's why I'm asking. And I didn't even know who Dawson was. I was really just like, hey, if you guys are jaying, let's put the King Nick on. And I don't know what nuked them. A lot of people say Abba and Preach nuked them with the... The monkey sounds he was making because they demonetized me and then a few days later fresh fit so it's a coordinated assault and that was my first big youtube paycheck so that was very depressing i didn't even think shorts can make you that much money or like shorts drive engagement for the vods i guess you talk like a woman stop gossiping i mean it you it's a live stream you have to talk like what am i gonna fight the camera Am I going to play a video game? We have to talk about the JQ. I know it makes you uncomfortable because you're an Andrew Tate. But your hero never JQ'd even softly. And when his brother did, he said he doesn't care. So the fact that your wife will be a...
your wife will not be a virgin all your life problems are because these guys won't step up just remember that what does jq mean it doesn't matter you're not that part of the internet go to andrew tate if you don't know i'm with the intellectual dark web i knew about jq when i was in high school but it wasn't it didn't become super real to me until they nuked me and nick four years ago at the same time they nuked me then nick two days later when he was on scuff podcast The cool thing is internet never forgets like they can nuke every platform and hundreds of thousands of people literally watched John Zerka do something Andrew and Tristan won't do and not in a stupid way like Dawson. But yeah, I don't think you guys should obsess over that. I think you guys should obsess over. Who was the most honest on the internet? If you obsess over that, especially if you're a Christian, then you stop asking stupid questions like, like, hand on God, I, John Zerka, am one billion times more honest than Andrew and Tristan. And I did it four years ago, and then I redid it as I popped off to prove I'm not a capitalist. Just because I make money doesn't mean I didn't lose more than I ever made. You know what I mean? Yeah, which is funny. I'm the entertainer. No, I'm the political operative in the ruling class's eyes. Not that they know us, but like the way the algorithm's set up to damage us. They're considered entertainers. Isn't that funny? The funny guy is not the entertainer. Those guys are. But I... I do the comedy thing, you know what I mean? Like, if you really think about it, you guys owe me so much, dude. You guys owe me so much power and money and to just keep lifting me to the top. I've done, sacrificed everything. Not even for you guys, bro. I did it for God. Because the coolest thing I've ever seen is when someone said, Zerka, if you went phony today, you did more than anyone in the last 70 years, like, or 40 years, if you don't count yay. So I could go fake today and I will die honest. You know what I mean? I could do whatever. I could start doing toy commercials about Fisher Price. I could be the blippy guy. I could shark do, 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 do. I could do that for 10 years and I'll be more honest than the Tate brothers. So oh, he's attacking 0.00001% of the population that holds literally 0% power. And it's the same script as Ben Shapiro on these guys. And it's like, and they go, okay, we're going to do COVID lockdown, but curfew only at 8 p.m. Like, that's how they gauge. Uh, Yuri Bezmanov said it best for ideological subversion, the KGB defector. He explained that the best, I think. Or maybe I'm mixing it up. So, yeah, I'm so tired of people talking about authentic, okay? If we're talking authentic, Nick, even though I, I did this before I knew who Nick was, but he did it the best. Nick, Zerka, Dawson, which I don't, I hate the guy, but I'm honest. I'm whatever. God is watching. I'm not going to look like a homo right now. And uh, Sneak was in top 10 because he disavowed everything he did for us. And I hate saying everything he did for us because people think Nick and I were secretly friends and we're CIA. And no, I mean us as in like everyone who's willing. No, no, no. Nick Myron, because Myron put the robe on. That's too much. Nick Myron, then Zerka. And Myron has a bigger platform, so more risk. But then if we look at that way, Sneeko beats me because he lost the whole YouTube. But would Sneeko do it as he's a rising star like Zerka? I seriously doubt it. I'm going to lose friends with Aiden Ross if I do this. Oh, no.
Dude, if you're afraid of losing friends in this game, it means you don't think you're talented. So yeah, you know, you can say I'm all a bad friend. Never snaked one person in my online career. And don't ever say it's the guy I almost caught bullets for Destiny. I don't think he caught bullets for me, bro. I kind of wish that black guys shot me so people could be like, the guy that Destiny treats the worst on his stream, John Zerka caught a bullet for that little. You know what I mean? So call me an asshole, call me whatever you want. And I see comment sections turning on me, my own clips channel comment sections. And that's when I said, like, I swear to God, if you're a supporter of mine, but you think Sneeko's in the right, I spit on your mother, especially if you're a subscriber. I spit twice. Because you're a subscriber and you're doubting me? I lost too much. And if we look at, well, John, you talk about being a on paper millionaire, so like you're a sellout. And no, no, no. Let's talk about how much money I lost being myself. Then we can compare. I'm almost tempted to do the Andrew Tate route, do a couple of things, hire a bunch of these girls who are in love with me anyway. Like, I look them in the eyes, I go, I'm using you. And they go, I'm still in love, John. One day you're going to change. And I can literally get 50% of their paycheck with these girls. I can literally get a Bugatti tomorrow and then say, what's the deal with transgender? And everyone, I'm a populist, everyone loves me. And then, and then what? That's selling your soul. No, I'm not Fousey on a wish. I'm straight Fousey. <laughs> How can you forgive yourself? You never forgive yourself. You're always gonna sin. No, his name is Zerka Live. Zerka Live. Go to Zerka Live. Zerka, look up Zerka Live. I like that channel.